What's going on, guys? Johnny with Blazer Grass Lawn Care. So, um, I wanted to make a quick video, guys. Um, so I posted just now, um, on my Instagram page in regards to I was putting up my, uh, you know, you guys know that I have. Well, for you guys that have been following us for a while, you know that I have a uh, two robotic lawnmowers. <clears throat> um, one in the back one in the front and uh you know the one in the back is uh clippy the one in the front is blade and they both you know cut my yard and right now see my grass is dormant i have bermuda grass that's tank and bella <laughs> they're playing so don't worry about them um so i have bermuda grass so you know it's dormant so what i did is uh i went ahead and uh you know put them up for the season um, this is where, right here, this is where Clippy resides. But, uh, you know, we went ahead and, and, and put them up. I should have put these dogs up for some reason. But um, what this video is about, guys, is I, I posted it on Instagram. And uh, I got, well, I, I will look at this way. Anytime I post about the robotic lawnmower, I get a pushback. I get a pushback from from a lot of you guys um you know not you in particular <laughs> but i get a lot of pushback oh i can't believe uh that you are uh, uh telling people about robotic lawnmowers you are showing customers that they don't need our service you know we're out here busting our ass and and you showing robotic lawnmowers you know we are number one we are businessmen right i'm a businessman I'm about business, right? And you, my, my opinion, you as a business owner should be thinking about technology. You should be thinking about making your job easier and being more profitable. You see what I mean? You know, those days about busting your ass and, and working hard and, and working from, from sun up to sundown, you shouldn't be thinking that way. Not my opinion. You shouldn't be thinking that way, man. Come on. You know, this is technology. You know, embrace new technology and have an open mind and, and think out of the box. Think about, you know, how can this technology benefit my business? That's, that's the way you should be thinking. You know, don't think about, you know, your goal is to have a long care business and get out there and work from sun up to sundown and bust your ass. It doesn't work like that. You know, my goal is to consolidate my properties and have my guys go one, two, three, four, five, and get the heck up out of there. That's why I say at the end of my video, pop smoke, old military term. Get in there, do your job and leave. You know, I hate, I hate to see. Um, and I see a lot of my peers out here, man, you know, you, they, they get on a property and they move so freaking slow. They take an hour or two for something that should be taking 20 minutes. See what I mean? You're not being profitable. Yes, you have a thousand lawns and you're working from sun up to sundown. But then here I am with my crew. We do 15, 16 properties by, you know, you're looking at 3, 30, 4 o'clock. And you still working at sundown. You know, trying to still finish your number 10 property. You know what I mean? It doesn't, it shouldn't be like that, man. You know, remember, you are a business owner. Embrace technology. My goal is to have my robotic lawnmowers on certain customers' property. Because keep in mind, you can't have them in every property, right? Certain properties, you put them on there. And all you have to do is take one guy to go out there and just turf line, edge, and blow. That's it. And you're still making the same amount and even more money than you were before. That's the goal. You always have to take technology and embrace it. Keep in mind, guys, you know, Sears, Circuit City, all those guys, man, you never sell clothes on the Internet. People are not going to shop on the Internet. People are going to come to your store and buy your stuff. They never embrace it. And where are they now? Where are they? Nowhere to be found, right? You know, we still have, you know, guys out there. And again, I'm not criticizing anyone. Don't take this the wrong way. 
I'm not criticizing you. I just want you to open your mind. You know, um, you're, 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 you're going out there and, and you're still coming back. You see these juggers? <laughs> you're still coming back after the mow and you come back days later trying to get your money, right? Because you're picking up your money. You, you, you're, you are scared to have, tell your customers, hey, listen, we, uh, we have only take credit cards, you know, put your card on file and then we'll debit your card. You know, everybody else is doing it. What makes you different? Huh? Why, because you're mowing grass? That's, what, that's the way you feel? Come on, man. That's not the way I feel, you know? All my customers pay with a credit card on hand, except a handful of customers. And that's because I had them for years, right? So, so I wanted to make this video, guys, just to let you know, when you see something new, because I'm about technology, and I'm about changing up equipment. That's why every every couple of years you see me with a brand new mower. Anything that's new, I want. That's 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 the way I do things. Okay? Anything every anything that's new, I want it. And I get with these guys and I get with the companies and say, send me this stuff, I want to try it out. Right? And then you take care of your equipment and then you trade it in and get something new. You know, that's the way you should be thinking. Okay? So I don't want to waste your time, guys. I just want you to know that you need to embrace technology okay don't take things and automatically say no the easiest thing to do is to say no i want to go out there and do it the hard way if that's the case then go buy your machete and put down your push mower or your, or your lawnmower and go cut grass right come on guys it might sound ridiculous but that's the way some of you guys sound to me when 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 you say oh here he goes with the auto mower Guys, let me tell you, anybody can have a long care business, but we all can be profitable. And those who, em who embrace technology are the ones that are going to profit and are going to grow their business. Because guys, let me tell you, man, labor is expensive. You guys keep saying, you know, everybody's complaining, labor, 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 you need people. And nowadays, people are kind of hard to come by, all right? All right, guys, I hope this made sense to you. Put your comments below, okay? And don't and listen, the first thing you're gonna tell me is everybody can't afford it, and I understand that. But you can also save your money, right? Little by little, and eventually, you know, make it to where you wanna be, right? I always have a positive attitude, man. That's, that's what will take you, man. Think about ways to making your business profitable and more efficient, and not about how many properties can you get. Now is how many profitable pr profitable properties you can get within a day in order to do less work and make more money. Have a blessed one, man. Pop smoke. Peace.